everyone and welcome to the Nashville vlog. Hi, my name is May Elaine. I'm a singer-songwriter from London and I wanted to take you along my month-long Nashville adventure. This video is just the first week, but it's gonna feature a lot of boots, a lot of good food, and some behind the scenes of new music. So let's go. Good morning from Nashville. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm saying that. I have arrived in Nashville, got in last night. It's currently like eight o'clock. I managed to sleep till like 4.30, which is pretty good. And I actually don't know what I've spent my last bit of time doing. Currently walking from the Gulch down to Broadway. I am so full from that smoothie bowl, but it was insane. It was so good. I need to pick up my hire car this afternoon because I figured if I'm here for like a month, I need to learn how to drive and I need to just do it. But I am so terrified to drive here. I feel like it's so different. The roads, I mean, I know it's helpful that the roads are big, but there's just so much difference from in England that it's kind of hard to work out. But anyway. how the hell I'm gonna drive this car. What's so funny is they said they'd given me a small car. And look at it. I'm not sure I'd call this small. It's Izzy! I managed to plan my flights pretty well and so I landed on a Friday, meaning I had the weekend to kind of settle into my routine, explore a bit, get over the jet lag. So on my first Saturday there, I decided to hit all the vintage shops in East Nashville, which is always the best start to a trip. So I would do a little update while I just grab my things to go to dinner. I think I'm going to take my notebook so I can start journaling about my trip. I've had a pretty busy, jam-packed day in Asheville. Um, I picked up my car today, which, oh, the actual driving is really easy, but I feel like the drivers are way more aggressive. So I'm going to head to dinner now. I'm going to a place called Lachlan. <laughs> Lachlan table, I think. I'm just gonna walk in and hope that they can find a seat for, for one. I bought these overnight oat pots called Mush, which I had last time I came here, and they are amazing. They're really, really good. So I bought one of those and I thought I'm going to have that. And then I'm going to cut up some strawberries. And I think after my workout, I might go and get a smoothie. You can probably hear, but there is a monster, a monster storm going on. I'm sitting in my driveway, trying to work out how I get from here into there. I don't know if I just risk it, I just run and get wet, or if I wait, but it doesn't look like, it doesn't look like it's stopping anytime soon. I just got back from the gym. I'm having some breakfast. I bought another one of these. I still have one of these mush overnight oat pots, so I thought I'd have one of these. But I thought I would come and check out the local park and I wanted to see what it was like. I have a 
have a new friend coming over here to do some writing today. So I am going to have a quick little tidy up. Okay guys, so I've been wanting to try a Japanese sweet potato for the longest time. And we don't have them in England, I don't think. But I found one. I know the best way is to bake it. But... I don't have time for that. So apparently this is the way you can do it. Okay, my sweet potato is in the microwave. She's spinning round. Actually looks really good. Wow, it kind of tastes like dessert. I've definitely had a few moments today where it's hit me that like, oh, I'm here alone for a while. Play stupid games and stupid pride. Session now. Had some breakfast, done a walk. The sun was shining this morning. It's coming out again. I'm in a good mood. good session as you saw it i'm now heading down to Charles south because they have a farmer's market here on a tuesday afternoon so i wanted to check that out G. C. Oh, C. Sometimes I think about that. Think about that day. Might be accidental. A butterfly flapped its wings and now I'm wasted potential. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah. I like the word playing off of the, the accidental lyric. Unfortunately for this next part of the vlog, I can't actually show you everything I would like to, but we filmed something very, very exciting on this day. It was so fun just to be able to be creative, run around Nashville, and film something that you guys are going to see pretty soon, I want to say. And then I ended the day at this ramen place, and oh my goodness, I think it's the best ramen I've ever had. Let's go to yoga! Good morning, it's currently Saturday. I have just got ready for the day. 
you can't see the outfit, but I'll show you later. And I just came back from a yoga class, which was so nice and such a nice start to the morning. And now I'm gonna go and get some breakfast. And then I'm also going to go and check out like a little local market, um, which has some vintage, some food, all sorts of stuff. I'm, I'm so excited for the market. Here's my outfit. I don't think it's in focus, but there we go. Just have dungarees on, little top bag, boots. Let's go. Okay, we have made it to Sun Life Organics and I'm gonna do a taste test of the form smoothie. Let's try it, like a smoothie. Mm. Hold on. That's really good. Wow! On first sip, I wasn't 100% convinced. I couldn't quite work it out. And everything was flying around. Like, that's really good. spending the day out and I'm just sitting out reading It's gonna get really warm later, so I think I'm gonna have a little bit of a pool day, which will be so fun with my friend Emma. had such a nice day today honestly such a lovely time i went to farmer's market and then i went to my friend emma's pool and we just hung out had a pool day with her and one of her friends and it was so nice just to chat and sit and be in the water and then lay by the pool in the sun and the weather was perfect it was 25 degrees today which i think is my ultimate favorite temperature 25 degrees is just the most perfect weather Looking around the neighbourhood, it's honestly just so cute around here. I am so happy with where I picked to stay. It's gorgeous and everyone's so friendly. It feels like super safe, super easy to walk around. And I just love wandering around. 